Completing the manhole detail. In the previous lesson, construction of a manhole detail began. New tools and snaps were introduced to assist in creating this geometry accurately and efficiently. In this lesson, you'll learn several new placement and manipulation commands to help complete the manhole frame and cover detail. While you work through the lessons in this course, you will place block, place circle, place line, place arc, mirror. Continuing in the site plan details DGN file, set the active level to detail 00, zero. and the color line style and line weight by level. Now what we're going to do next is draw a profile center line for the manhole detail. From the home tab in the placement ribbon group, pick place line. In the tool settings, set the following. For the length, 30. For the angle, 270. Press F11 to bring AccuDraw into focus and in the view window, move your cursor to the snap mode as shown here. Press O to issue the AccuDraw origin shortcut. The AccuDraw compass will appear at the snap location. As needed, press M to activate the AccuDraw mode shortcut, putting AccuDraw in a rectangular coordinate readout. Now, move the cursor to the right and key in 13.5. Move the cursor upward and key in 7. Place the line with a data point. Take note. This vertical center line will be used to represent an axis of symmetry from right to left. Next, we're going to mirror the manhole detail profile. From the Manipulate Ribbon Group, pick Mirror. In the tool settings, set the following. For the mirror direction, vertical. Disable About Element Center and Enable Make Copy. In the view, select a geometry by clicking and dragging a selection rectangle. You can do this by holding down the left mouse button approximately from this point here to this point here. Now, release the mouse button selecting the geometry. Begin the mirror by placing a data point anywhere in the view. Move the cursor to the vertical line locating a snap point along its length. Accept the mirror with a data point. Reset to complete the command. Set the active level as detail 02, leaving color, line style, and line weight to by level. Now, we're going to continue the manhole detail profile. From the placement ribbon group, pick place block. Move your cursor to the snap point as illustrated. Press F11 to bring AccuDraw into focus. Press O to issue the AccuDraw origin shortcut, causing the AccuDraw compass to appear at the snap location. Now, move your cursor to the right and key in 0 0.5. Begin placing the shape with a data point. Move the cursor to the right and key in 26. Move the cursor upward and key in 1. Using place line, place line segments between locations 1 and 2 and locations 3 and 4 by snapping to the existing corners. Next, we're going to complete the manhole detail profile. From the placement ribbon group, pick Place Arc and set the following. 
for the method, start, end, mid, and for the radius, 17. Place the arc start and end points as shown. There will be two solutions found for placing the arc as denoted by the indicators in the view window labeled as 0 or 1. Move the cursor downward and accept solution 1. Now we're going to create the manhole cover top view. From the placement ribbon group, pick place circle and set the following. For the method, center, the area set to solid, for the fill type, none, and the radius, 10. Press F11 to bring AccuDraw into focus. Using AccuSnap, locate the midpoint of the line as shown. Press O to issue the AccuDraw origin shortcut. Move the cursor to the left and key in 27. Place the circle with a data point. Continue to place concentric circles using the following values for the radius. For circle 2, 13. To help keep the circles concentric, you may snap to the center of the first circle placed. For circle 3, 13.5. For circle 4, 14.5, and for circle 5, 17. During this lesson, the manhole detail was completed using a variety of element placement and manipulation commands. These commands included place circle, place arc, and mirror element. AccuDraw and snapping were also utilized to precisely complete the geometry placement. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.